Ladies and gentlemen, classical family, it's your boy Giddy back with another reaction. Hope y'all are doing good. I'm doing great. Today we are reacting to a composer that always guarantees me a smile. And it's Nikolai Kapustin, piano concerto number two. The pianist is Dimitri Masliv. So um I was I was watching or I saw I saw the first bit, like the first 10 seconds of this video and I reacted to this on Twitch a while ago, but I completely forgot. But you know what? If we're here, I'm gonna listen to it again because it was a while ago and it's Kapustin. I'm going to listen to it again. So yeah, hope y'all still enjoy the reaction. For those that haven't seen that one, I think it's on my Twitch channel. I never uploaded it on here, but yeah, let's get right into it.
It's not even over yet. It's not even over yet. Oh. Amazing. That's the elevator, elevator music. I love it though.
It's not over yet. It's not over yet. Or I like the place. We'll talk at the end. Yes, sir. Bravo. Amazing, amazing. 
That was very good. That was very good. Hey, a cheer from me. <laughs> yeah, I mean Kapustin he's 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 a different composer. Um I think one one thing that really stood out to me the first time that I heard a piece by Kapustin was it sounded really jazz like and I have listened to jazz before, you know. So when I heard that jazz kind of vibe in his piece for the first time, I felt immediately connected to it. And and I think that was also the first time that I had ever felt this connection this fast. Because normally it takes a while to kind of build a connection with a composer you've never heard before. But for me, it clicked immediately. And I also remember telling y'all, if Kapustin was the first composer that I ever listened to when I started doing reactions, he would definitely be like my favorite, favorite composer. And I consider him one of my favorite composers ever since y'all introduced me to him because he's just amazing and he just stands out. And I don't know which other composer that stands out this much for me as Kapustin. But for example, Prokofiev for me is a composer that really stands out. Y'all know that. But his music still sounds like classical music. With Kapustin, it, it, it's not like that. In my opinion, it's not like that. Like, it doesn't sound like classical music. And every piece that I've listened to up until now by Kapustin has been a hit. Like, I haven't had any misses. But yeah, classical fam, let me know down in the comments how y'all feel about this piece, this performance. Like, is there a Kapustin piece that you want me to react to? Let me know down in the comments. And... I hope y'all enjoyed the reaction as much as I did. I enjoyed the video, obviously, and the piece. And yeah, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. It's been your boy Giddy. I'm going to catch you on the next video.